Hello. In this video, we'll be creating a simple Go web application. Let's get started. To write the code, you can use any text editor that you like. You'll also need the Go runtime installed. For this video, I'll be using Cloud Shell from Google Cloud Console. For this, you'll need a Google Cloud project. In this case, I have my Google Cloud project selected. I'll be activating the Cloud Shell. I'll be creating a new folder for our project. I'll then open Editor. Finally, I'll open the folder that I just created as a workspace. I will initialize a new Go application by running Go mod init hello. We'll create a new main.go file that will have all our code. Finally, we'll open our new main.go file to start editing. We'll start off by creating a package main. We'll create a main function that will be the starting point of our application. We'll call HTTP handle func and serve request coming to the root of our application. We'll work on this handler function in a second. We'll have to import the net HTTP package. We'll create a new variable called port and try to get that value from the environmental variable if set. We'll also be importing OS. If the value of port is not set, we'll set port to 8080. We'll give a friendly log printout to tell us that's the port we're listening in. Finally, we'll start our application on port 8080. We'll also wrap our HTTP listen and serve in a log.fatal because we don't want our application to start if our server cannot start. We'll also be importing log. Next, we'll create our handler function called handler. Handler func is any function that has the signature of response writer and pointed to a request as input. We will log out a friendly message. We will then create a new variable called target which we will get from the environmental variable. If target is not set, we will set target to world. Finally, we will write back hello and whatever is set to target to our response. We will import package font. That's all the code we need. Now we are ready to test that our application works. We can start our application by running go run main.go. Once we see that our application is running on localhost 8080, we can open up a second terminal and curl localhost 8080. We will see we get back hello world. Also, we'll get the friendly log output that says hello world received a request. That's all for this video. In a future video, we'll be using this code to deploy an application to Cloud Run and GKE.